This is Code Combat, uh, the JavaScript version. We're doing Introduction to Computer Science. This is level 16, Master of Names. Goals, you hero must survive, defeat the three ogres. Variables contain information to be referenced later. You can assign a new variable to a variable anytime, a new value to a variable anytime you want. Yep, use find nearest enemy to target the nearest enemy. Variable closest enemy equals hero find newest enemy. What this does then is you have now created, or they have, a variable named closest enemy. You then say, hey, hero, look around. Whoever is closest to you, that would be enemy one, they are now named closest enemy, right? So it's a really useful way if you don't have a name, if you don't know the name of them, you can tell your hero to look around and then you can just give them a name and that way you can interact with the uh, person or the ogre. So again, variables are just like in math when you have x and y and you know 2 plus x equals 4, x really represents 2, right? That's what enemy 1 is. It's a variable. But instead of representing a number, it's going to represent whoever is closest to our hero, whatever enemy is. Um, and as I stated earlier, these can be anything. So enemy two will work, right? We're gonna go kill this guy. He's gonna look around and then he names this guy enemy two. So I'm gonna pause this and go back a little bit. Right here, he looks around, he spots this guy and find nearest enemy, I see you. And if you see enemy two is already defeated but he's on the ground here. So you could name that person again, whatever, just like in math, X and Y. It's not representing a number, it's a variable that represents, at this point, whoever's closest to our hero. And it will function the same. See, and now it says Y here. So, finally, we're going to do variable. I think what they are looking for is enemy 3, but it really doesn't matter. I could do Bob again, or dude. It, as long as whatever I use for the variable is the same as what I'm using to attack. So I used, I did use enemy three, enemy three again, and that should take care of it. Variables are a bit confusing at first, but they are going to be very, very useful to us. And we are victorious, so we're gonna go ahead and move on to level 18, up oh, level 17. <laughs> Level 17.